Here's how to create a new Feedback Fruits activity in your course in Microsoft Teams. Let's start logged into our Teams environment as a teacher and inside our Introduction to Communication Science course. Let's add a Feedback Fruits activity. Up at the top here, I can create a new tab to add new content, so clicking on the plus icon, I'll be shown a selection menu where I can choose Feedback Fruits and then select which tool I'd like to use, whether that's for feedback, interactive content, or more. For now, let's set up a peer review activity. Clicking on peer review, I'll be shown the setup screen. I'll quickly add a title and some instructions, and click save here at the top, and then clicking once more on save to publish this. Here it is. I can continue editing, adding instructions, deadlines, or groups by clicking the three dots at the top right here. Or if I need to delete this activity, I can click on this little arrow by the assignment name, selecting Remove, and then pressing Delete, then Remove. And that's all you need to do to add Feedback Fruits activities to Microsoft Teams. It's also good to know that if at any time you need help setting up or troubleshooting your activities, you can contact our support with the button in the bottom left on the screen. And human support is usually under five minutes away, 24 hours a day on weekdays. If you're not sure whether you have access to Feedback Fruits, you can visit the Partners page on our website and press Check My Institution. And if you'd like to get started with Feedback Fruits for the first time, check out our Educators Initiative or book a demo.